Walking through the Vandenberg County Humane Shelter this past Saturday evening, there was not a sound to be heard. For two days last week, the Humane Shelter had the promotion, Empty the Shelter. Kendall D. Paul, the Executive Director, explained the event. This is an amazing opportunity for us here at the VHS. We do specials, but this is the first time we've ever done an Empty the Shelter event where we're waiving the fees on all of the animals, dogs, cats, and rabbits. So as people come in, they're giving applications, they're waiting in line very patiently, I'm glad, uh, and then they're going to a screening process. Once their applications have been screened, then we let them go throughout the shelter to look at the animals that we have. If they see an animal that they like, our volunteers are tagging them with a green collar, and then from there they can finish the adoption. And because most of these animals have already been spayed or neutered, they get to go right home. With an understanding of the event, we got in line and followed Krista Long, her husband, and two sons through the process of adopting their new cat. It's Christmas time, but we always open our home to animals. We have currently three dogs that we've rescued, all three of them, and we have two cats that we've rescued. And we just feel like we need one more stocking hung. I'm going to get to name it, and I'm going to pick it from my mom and dad's options. Do you guys see any you're interested in maybe getting to know a little better? After passing through screening, the Long family spent quite some time browsing their options in search for their newest addition to their family. But the funniest name I have come over, Mustard. Once they had encountered all the cats in the shelter, there was one that stood out from all the rest. With a potential new furry friend in mind, now comes the moment of truth. While you can glance at a pet through the glass, nothing is quite certain until both of you are able to meet. This litter has actually come quite a long way. They're pretty nervous when they first came in. They are very sweet, so it may be a little bit of an adjustment period. You guys are more than welcome to visit for as long as you like. If you have any questions, find me or just anyone else with an name tag, and we'll be able to help you out, okay? Their quality one-on-one -on -one time with Mustard provided them specific information about him and a chance to interact. In just a few short minutes, the Lang family's hearts were won and the green tag went on. Now, the only thing left was to finalize the adoption. We know that they're gonna fill back up really quickly, but the animals that we're getting out of here today didn't have to be euthanized because of space, because more animals were coming in. So that's the best part about it, is that these animals have been saved, they're gonna have families, and hopefully we'll hear from them down the road with pictures of the dogs laying on their couch or the cat curled up on their bed and just letting us know that these animals are doing well.